Fighting 101! Uh, hello? Yay! Is this thing on? Uh-oh, these cave dots are not cooperating! I need to do some serious dino wrangling! <laughs> Rock an idea, Tyra! Let's transform this class into some fun games! And five-minute crafts will help us make it dynamite! Let's ride! <laughs> dino riding takes a lot of practice, but here's a fun way to give it a triassic try! Let's make a dino hop game so they can practice their lizard leaps! For this game, we'll need thick paper and foam paper of different colors, a pencil, a marker, safety scissors, and non-toxic glue. This is gonna be so t rex -lent. Oh, why don't we make them in the shape of feet? Wait a stegosaur a second! You can play this game at home too! All you need to do is make dino footprints, put them on the floor, and boom! You and your family can do the dino hop with us! Now that's really rockin'! Looks so cool! Wow! <laughs> yes! Now that's how you give it the old Triceratops try! I'll make dino riders out of you yet! All right, now on three, one, two, three. Oh, these little jumpers don't have any rock and rhythm. Luckily, I know just how to fix it. Let's roll on into our next craft. When you ride a dyno, you really have to go with the flow and feel the rhythm of the movement. Music is a great way to train your senses. So let's make a dyno-sized xylophone. Yeah! For this, we're using wooden branches, non-toxic glue, non-toxic paint, and bamboo straws. The xylophone is a kind of percussion instrument. Percussion means that you take something and beat it against something else to make sounds. If I know those cave tots, I think they're gonna love this. Xylophones are so great! Oh, do you think Bashley will let me play back up to her guitar? Oh, that would be Superstarosaurus for real! <laughs> I can't wait to hear our tots and dinos give this a cave-tastic can-do! <laughs> <laughs> that sounds awesome! You're such quick learners! Okay, now it's Dino's turn! <laughs> Guess they didn't want to play it the right way! <laughs> Who am I kidding? There is no right way! Feel free to make music however you want! Next lesson, physical education! First up, a swing! It takes two to work it, so hopefully this will create a dynamic dino duo out of wannabe riders! We'll need wooden branches, non-toxic glue, non-toxic paint, a piece of cardboard, safety scissors, a colorful piece of yarn, and felt paper. Swings are the best! Not only are they literally the best part of any playground, they'll help out future dino riders get used to the sway of long dino rides! Guys, we've done a great job! This swing is just awesome! Let's show it to our class! They love it! Alright! Uh, but they need some help to get it going! <laughs> Look! Tyra explained to them how to work together! And with that, it's time to swing on over to our last game! This climbing wall is the perfect way to teach balance and teamwork! To make this wall, we'll need non-toxic foam blocks, a safe modeling tool, colorful clay, plastic rolling pin, and colorful rocks. Games can teach us so much! Ever played hide and seek? If you have, then you've learned how to use the environment and space around you. Yay learning! It's been pretty cool since prehistory. Last time I played hide and seek with Tyra, she thought she could hide out in a teeny tiny cave. Let's just say it took the whole cave club to get her out. It's ready! Let's go show the riding class their new climbing wall! Oh! Oh no! <laughs> Yeehaw! Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Dino score! That's what I call teamwork! I hope you enjoyed making these awesome DIYs with me! Thanks to 5 Minute Crafts for all these awesome ideas! Now let's hear it for our new team of dino riders! <laughs> the Cave Dogs! <laughs> hey! Wait for me! Yay! Together.